welcome back to Dickie's Beer Review. We're at the Snatch Block Lounge again with Scotty B. How you doing? He's hosting us again. And uh, today we're going to try the Linen Kugels. Linen Kugels. Grapefruit Shandy. I knew I wasn't going to be able to say it. It says uh, it's from Chippewa Falls, Wisconsin. And Linen Kugels makes a fantastic beer. The uh, Summer Shandy is absolutely delicious. The guy that uh, I saw at the liquor store, uh, one of the distributors was talking this up, uh, saying that everybody was looking for this grapefruit uh, beer, and uh, that Lime and Kugels made something that was delicious, so we're gonna give it a shot. We'll try it. Grapefruit? I'm not a grapefruit fan, but we'll see. Yeah, we'll see. All right, let's see that magic All bottle. All right, <laughs> your trusty uh, bottle of We're gonna try this one again. All right. There you go, let you do the honors. Hey, you're a pro at that. Oh, I almost did it. I almost screwed it up. You almost messed it up? Man, that thing has never failed me. But if anybody could fail, it would open be here, it would be you. Oh, yeah. I... Oh, God. That's this is a nose full of grapefruit. So, envision cutting a grapefruit in half and then sniffing it. Wow. It smells like something I've had before. I'm going to church it up. I, I, love, <laughs> I love what Dick said in one of his other videos, so with the same Adams class. We're going to church it up in the blue moon glasses. It smells like a, like a V8 grape, ju grapefruit juice. I don't know. V8 makes one, but that's what it smells like. Does V8? I, I don't know what I mean. I, you know, just tomato. drinking tomato juice like grosses me out. I don't, I don't know if V8 makes a... Great looks like one. The, does it look like the shandy a little bit? I mean, it's, it looks like a half a bison. It's yeah, cloudy. That's um, that <laughs> little bit ahead on that. If we had smeller vision, that would. Oh be my good. god, that'll knock you out. That'd be like, that's great for me. It doesn't taste as much. I don't. It doesn't taste like what I thought it would. <laughs> it you doesn't taste like, like you think it smells like, worse than it is? Yeah, I think the smell is stronger than the taste. I agree. I mean, it, I don't think it's not bad. That's a mouthful of grapefruit. There's got to be something else in that besides grapefruit because it doesn't taste like I thought it was gonna. Maybe it's the honey. Is there honey in it? It says brewed with honey, the natural flavor added. Grapefruit shiny. Huh. I don't know, I actually kind of like it. This is, not, this is like something if it is a hot day. And it's like a hot day at breakfast. Fresh. This is, this is yeah, what it is. Breakfast. This is a breakfast beer. So with eggs, a side of eggs. And side of eggs. And uh, would you like some grapefruit juice uh, with your breakfast? Yes, I'll have a grapefruit shandy. I don't think it tastes like grapefruit, like grapefruit juice straight up. I think, I taste like lemon a little bit, I don't know. It does. It does have a little lemony. Maybe it's that sour. I don't know, I kind of like it. I, I'm surprised that I like it. Huh. Yeah, because it smelled awful. Yeah, it smelled like it. Like you said, a nose full of grapefruit, it hits you. No. Yeah. All right. I think, yeah. I mean, it doesn't have much aftertaste, which no, is good. Yeah. You don't want to have a mouthful of grapefruit uh, throughout the day uh, or your drinking session. I, I don't know, I taste more lemon than I do. It's still got that smell, though. I think it just deadens all your nerve endings, and then you're like, oh, your okay, tongue now says, I can tolerate it. Your tongue it. says, what the hell? Right, what the hell are you putting out of my... Right, I think you drink uh, two what? sips of this and then um, all your nerve endings are dead to the taste and then you can finish the rest of it. Yeah, I couldn't eat a grapefruit, but I can drink this. I gotcha. Well, right. What are you going to rate it? I think I would... I, I might give it a high three. There's no such thing as a high it's three. It's not my favorite, but I mean, but I could drink it again. And it, I think a two would be something that I probably wouldn't drink again. Right, I agree. And it's not awesome, 
like Michelob Ultra, so I won't give it a five or a four. Yeah. All right, I'm going to say three. I'll go three, but I like it. Oh, good for you. Good pick. All right. Thanks, Scotty. Again, my pleasure. All right, I think we got more of the bar in this, in this video, too. So. Cool. All right. Well, cheers. Thanks for watching Dickie's Beer Review. That's another one down. All right. Cheers.